Hi there, Trey with the Analytics 8. A recent groundswell in geospatial questions has led me to create a series of videos around basic geospatial questions. In this video, we're going to discuss drive time analysis. Drive time analysis is a way of understanding how far a customer must commute to be at a location. To understand commute time, you must understand the route a customer takes to get from where they are to you. So let's start by defining a route. A route consists of plotting the lines and turns between multiple points. This is different from a straight line or as the crow flies approach that is often used. Where the straight line approach doesn't take into consideration geographical features such as lakes and mountains that would get in the way of customers taking a direct approach to your location. Routing looks at the turns, traffic, and obstacles that add to a customer's commute, giving you a much more realistic approach to drive time. The issue that comes into play is finding the data that supports turn-by-turn -turn directions. Most people have come to expect it because of how simple Google and Apple have made it on your phone. However, Google and Apple are monetizing that information and not giving it all away for free. In order to get real drive time data, you have to have access to data that shows you how far a commuter must go before turning on the next road and what traffic conditions are at a given time of day. Many of the big players provide a subset of this information at no cost if you know how to pull it into your data and agree to their licensing terms. If you need more than that subset of data provided for free, be prepared to pay for it either directly to the data provider or in licensing maintenance costs associated with the software package. If you need help with this or have questions, feel free to reach out to us at Analytics 8. We're here to help. Until next time.